Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and I decided to go back and actually save Aya because I kind of cheated a little and looked at the guide and it's basically who lives and who dies doesn't change the ending of the game it just makes the battle harder or easier depending on who lives and who dies and considering I have have trouble with this game and fighting enemies I decided why not go save Aya because it will make my life easier to have three people fighting instead of two. So I went back and saved Aya and or at least I think I saved Aya. I got here with 20 seconds left. I don't know if she's going to be alive or not, but let's see. Aya, whew, found you. How could you wander off like that? You know that's dangerous. Oh, okay. She's alive. She got up. Sorry. It's just I was kind of tired. I wanted to rest and I didn't have the motivation. No motivation? This is not the time. I know, but it's just... Well... Hmm. Whoa! Hey, are you okay? Uh, sorry. I'm fine. Have you been eating right? Not really. That's no good. Doesn't your mom tell you to clean your plate? Yeah, she does, but... It's just... It's like I'm chewing on sand. Sand? Um, I don't really get that, but let's go back for now. Even as things are, we're standing around in somebody's garden. Hmm? What's up? It says Mizu Mizuoka on the door. Mizuoka Yuichi's last name. Making this Yuichi's house. Maybe. Want to go look? Feels like we gotta. Oh, you gonna be okay, Aya? Yeah, I'm fine. You don't sound fine. Okay, let's go in. Gotcha. Okay, so I saved Aya this time. Uh, can I? Oh, wait, how do I? Okay, that's how I open the menu. I'm gonna save over this. Because now I have Aya, so we're all good. And then I'm gonna skip ahead. Or, not really, I can skip all this text. And I need to know what to do. So, yeah. Oops. Read. Read. Skip. All of this stuff. Read that too. Why not? Oh. Does that not? Do I have to, like, examine everything? Because... Whoa! So much so. Hmm. Can I do it again? <laughs> I can do it again. Okay. So you have to look at everything to trigger this? Well, except for the bed, because I didn't look at that last time. Let's save before Merp. Close the menu. You kind of have to go in. <sighs> yep. 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 Er. Oh, okay. I was like, wait, he didn't examine him. We already heard all this. Let's go. Get a move on, guys. You and your Latin music. Go away. Nobody likes you. Actually, people saying that is what got us into this trouble in the first place. But you know, if you didn't go around killing people, then maybe we'd like you. Uh, do something. This. On this. We already read this. Fuck! I missed the out of the wrong person. Well, at least it's only... <laughs> I didn't expect Ray to be at the end. Of course you say it's bad. No, that's not either. He knows, but he's turned his head. Uh... I also kind of cheated on this. And looked up how to do this fight, because I have problems fighting bosses, okay? 
It doesn't. It didn't please him, so he turned it from a bad thing to a good thing. So impudent. What? Do you get what I mean? No, we don't. I like this whole glum thing. It works. Oh, wait, no. How do I go back? Gosh, I don't even know how to play this game. Can we finish this fight already, please? Like, and by finish, I don't mean you killing me. I mean you going away. Yay! Thank you, walkthrough. I love you. When your Latin is awfully. The mood. Oh, the mood's better than dad at is at this point. Ah, uh, just one. Just had a funny thought. There's a DVD on the shelf there. Familiar with the actress Manami Kaji? Yeah, I always looked up to her, even if she's retired now. A role model, eh? Too bad. Why? Because that DVD? It's a porno. With doggies joining the fun, too. What are you? You're like third grade! Looking up to an actress who gets licked all over by doggies, eh? Tell me how the pa that pans out. You just love to burst everyone's bubble, don't you? Licked by dogs? Well, he didn't say where, so, I mean, it's normal for people to get licked by their dogs, because, you know, he never said where. He left that up to your imagination. So, you could be like, hey, they're just licking her face because they love her. Now I want to look. <laughs> dogs violate filthy actress. This is some hardcore stuff. Yuichi's dad was such a perv. There's something in here. A note and a letter. I want to think this thing was mailed to me as a child's prank. But it's terrifyingly possible it was an adult. With the strange screams coming from my house, I have to wonder what the neighbors think. <laughs> it's really not good for my heart. If I hide it among porno, my wife will never touch it. She's not so childish as to look at my porn. So she knows you have porn. Okay, whatever. Do not lose hope. Instead, stand your ground. Everything will come in time. For you should not hurry. Rather, believe. Each thing you wish for, all will someday come. Keep an open mind and persist. Yikes. Huh? What's wrong? Didn't you notice? Read the first letter in each sentence. Hmm? Huh? Um. Die freak. How did you notice that? I didn't even notice that. There was a puzzle in the fantasy life like that, and I didn't notice it. And they're like, you so noticed it, right? And I was like, yeah, sure I did. They're like, read the first letter of every sentence. And I was like, oh, that makes sense now. Let's go back to base. Apparently, that's a very uh common theme. Because apparently they do it in Pandora Hearts too, and I didn't notice it. But then again, I didn't actually have to do anything to decode that. I just had to keep reading to the next page. So yeah, but still. Hey, how'd it go? Well, we didn't find any mistresses, but... But... Sorry, I... The depressed child... Huh, I see. But why would you do something so dangerous? Um, because she wants to die. And only now do I feel like shifting my stuff over because sitting here is awkward. I don't know. I just... Just? I've always thought about disappearing. Wanting to be alone and disappear. Because it's so hard. So you went off alone? Well, I understand how this could make you feel that way. No, it's not that. I've always felt like this for a long time. A long time? How long? Maybe about half a year. Nothing seemed fun anymore. But I'm not really sure why. Maybe I'm just gloomy. Actually, I, uh, maybe you're kind of like my dad. 
Huh? He's been in a real lousy mood. He seems sad a lot. He talks about wanting to die, but I don't think he's serious. Hey, me too. For me, it's my mom. She's always out of energy, doesn't want to eat, and doesn't get much sleep. It's worse in the morning, and she gets really lazy with breakfast, but after school, she seems a bit happier. Yeah, same here. Ray, my old man's always got this hopeless look, and he mopes around everywhere. Won't eat, either. Says it tastes like sand. That's why I was like, huh? When Aya mentioned it earlier. Weird. Same at my place. We read a book about this in Yuichi's house, remember? You too? Seriously? Yeah, and it's both my parents. Whoa, you have it tough. So, all your moms and dads are like me? I guess so, yeah. Huh, just coincidence? It'd be way too much of one. Hey, what about you, Shinsuke? Um, I... Don't like sand. It's coarse and rough and irritating. It gets everywhere. Why do I even ask? Whatever, let's focus on staying alive here. Yeah. Shinsuke, you're not even on topic. What the heck? I tried to joke about it, but it really disturbed me because my dad and mom were fine. Everyone has this one thing in common, but I don't. What could it mean? You're the chosen one, son. Not what I wanted. I stayed here. Do you have anything new to say? Getting kind of hungry. Whew. Here, whenever you need me. Dots. I've had my rest. I'm ready to go at any time. I'd like to come with you in day. Although, do you think we should get something to eat first? I'm not really hungry, but now is exactly the time for needing to be well fed. They're suited at the hag's shop. I think we can borrow some, given the circumstances. I guess you're right. The shop has lots of useful things, so maybe we could look around. What about we- what about after we get food? There's apartments by the shop. I think we should, should search them. Oh my gosh, this is worse than when I had a retainer. Alright. There could be something there. Alright, we'll go to the- I read all right twice. What the heck am I doing? We'll go to the hag shop and then to the apartment. Apartments. Okay, do I come back after the food? Let's put an end be what thing between us. I don't think so, boss. Unless you're okay with me sending home those embarrassing photos home. Oh, please, no, Mike. What? Are you up to pretend play, bleh, playing pretend adultery between boss and second? You guys are like in third grade. What's wrong with you? I figured it was a good distraction. Uh. For Mother's Day, I think I was thinking of giving my mom some flav favor tickets, but I decided on a different kind of ticket. Hmm? What? A parking ticket? Well, and she hasn't paid me yet. <laughs> uh, yeah, she wouldn't want to pay that one. Aya, you're kind of cute at times, you know that? He's still there. Oh god, I thought I was going to get into a fight. Alright, that should be enough food for everyone. Uh, okay, I'll just keep playing for now. After Kyoko Yano got divorced, she got way thinner. I guess breaking up did it. Maybe it was from the stress of divorce. The process just wore her out. Ugh, now you're onto something. Can I look at the shells? They all look... I don't know how you found food on this. They're like horrible looking. Ooh, I got a diamond bell. What is that for? I should save. Oh wait, no, this one. No, stop. Do you have alcohol with you there? Uh, nah, come on. Cooling pads could be useful. Whoa, they got root beer. This is my kind of shop. Is it any good? Dude, it's the berserker of the beverage world. I once went to a family trip to Okinawa and went to this A&W place where they poured this black liquid into a mug. I didn't know what I was ordering, so it scared the hell out of me. Huh. But putting it next to cool pads? That's just keeping the man down. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll continue on in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe and share this video with your friends. And I'll see you guys in the next episode of Rekinder. Bye!